Good evening, everyone. This is Chris Saraga from the 365. I am back down here at the Feather River uh, doing a little bit of drone recording because this is the few days after the spillway has uh, been turned off. So I'd like to show you what it looks like now. So here we go. Let's kind of get us back over the river. Oh my God, what is going on? Let's do that cable. Okay, let us get back over the river. There we go. Not my smoothest drone transition I've ever done. But here, we'll get us kind of moving forward. It's right over the river, so you can see what we saw the other day. You can see the low water marks there. It's a gorgeous day today. It was nice and warm like I like. gonna so let me get us up a little higher so to your right is the fish hatchery and to your left is the town of Oroville so right fish hatchery and Thermalito left the town of Oroville it's gonna get us right past these rapids here and turn us around there we go let's Turn us around and take a look back the way we came. So earlier I saw a boat out here. Let's see if that boat is still out in the general direction that we just came from. Also documenting this in general so that the folks of Orville will have a reference to what this river looked like before and now after these spills. So coming up towards that's the Thermalito Bridge right ahead of you. That part right there, you can see the white on the rocks. That is the high water mark for this last spill. Ah, and there's the boat right there. Here, we'll move forward a little bit. I have not seen anybody in a boat in this part of the river pretty much ever, so I'm not really sure why they're here, but let's get a good look at them. I mean, this is what a drone's for, right? There they are. I'm wondering if they might be surveyors. I don't actually know if it's legal to bring a boat up in this part of the river or not. Come down a bit. Get, the, get a little follow. There we go. Hmm. Well, that'll be a mystery for now. I'll fly ahead so we can see the rest of the river very interesting there. It's always neat to me to be able to fly uh, and have a target to track. So let's get us kind of aligned with the river a little more so you can get a beautiful shot. There we go. That's pretty good. Let's go forward. Come down a bit. Come down a little bit and get us going forward. Awesome. Oh, we got lots of birds. Whoa. There we go, we 
we got lots of birds around us. I think we're gonna kind of stay right there. Let's get moving forward here. All right. Having a little technical difficulty here. Let's see if we can get this going. Not with the drone, but with the equipment around it. There we go. Get you a good reveal shot. So to your left is the Feather River Fish Hatchery. What we are flying towards is the um, waterfall. Actually the dam, little coffer dam, that the sap they used to block the salmon's route up the river so they'll go into the fish hatchery. So there we go. Beautiful little shot there. Trying to basically fly the route that I did uh, last, I believe it was Friday. You can see the high water marks on the side of the river there. Now I'm going to bring us back, so we get a nice little reveal shot from this. That's called the Fish Barrier Dam. And there we go. Very nice shot there. Yeah, I know. Thank, thank you. Seems that we're having some problems with some sparrows. Haven't had that before. They don't really like the drone so much, but that's okay. Okay, I'm going to turn us around just to be sure. got lots of sparrows here today. Beautiful shot of Table Mountain there. Nice sunset. Let's see if we can find that boat again. Take a quick little look down the river. I actually don't see it. We'll fly towards this bridge a little bit. See if we can catch the boat. Pick this back up here. Just a gorgeous day today, like I said. Oh, and we are out of power. That might actually be a good spot to conclude this. So I'll give us a little quick fly. I'm gonna turn the recorder off just so you guys don't get an annoying beep. Thank you for watching. There'll be more videos like this soon. Have a great day. Bye. Good evening, everybody. This is Chris for the 365. I am back down at the Thermalito Bridge here to show you the water level now that it's come down from the spillway stopping uh, on Saturday. Today is Sunday. So let's take a look around. Here we go.
We're gonna bring you guys out towards, we're kind of flying into the sun here a little bit. But I'm gonna try to kind of get the same picture that we had the other day. There we go. All right, you are looking down the Feather River towards the west. This has just recently, this right now is around 12,000 cubic feet a second. This has recently been dropped by the DWR to that amount. They have turned the spillway off. So that is what we're checking out today. Flying down to your right is the Feather River Fish Hatchery. To the left is Orville, my hometown now. Oh, we got a boat up here. Let's go see what they're doing up there. You don't usually see boats out here. Let's see what they're doing. Well, this mission's just changed because I want to see what these people are doing in this boat. Who are they? Hmm. Let's follow. They're going fast. So you can see the high water mark there. They've had to slow down a little bit. Go underneath the bridge. I'm going to go over the bridge. But you don't you don't very often see somebody who has a boat. I can't tell if they are part of the DWR or fishing game or anybody but we're gonna follow them it's perfect actually because it kind of shows you we can see the how low the water has gone here I'm gonna get up over the bridge catch them on the other side very fun this is the kind of flying I love to do. So, here, let me kind of give you this view. I did this view for you guys the other day, so we'll do this first and then I'll catch back up with this boat. So that is a nice sunset picture. of the waterfall that's just in front, I guess at the very end actually, of the fish hatchery. Gorgeous little view there. I'm going to take us right over this waterfall and I'll fly us back, backwards. Yeah, that's beautiful. Just a little further. Okay, and then we'll fly us back. Oop. Backwards is not quite as easy. Got some birds in the way there. I guess I'm in the way of the birds. There we go, beautiful reveal shot there, like I said the other day. It's a little noisy out here. I'm using a handheld recorder to make sure that we actually get the audio from this this time. Okay, let's turn around and find that boat. Hmm. 
lost them. Well, where did they go? I don't know. Hmm. And I'm gonna have to restart this because I didn't turn on the recorder. So, just stop this. <laughs>